What's up, my baby daddies, and welcome back to my channel. I don't know why I keep falling out my heels. I think I'm getting old, my knees are getting bad. Thank you. Aesop posts new things every day of the work week, and I'm here to show you guys my favorite pieces every week. I like to give you guys announcements, and I actually did make a pretty big announcement on my Instagram today, this morning. So if you guys wanted to go and check that out, uh, my Instagram is down below. It's hi, I'm Amara. So go to my Instagram and just read what I had to say. It wasn't nothing big. I'm also gonna put the snippet for my fundraiser on my IGTV today, so, or if not today, tomorrow. So if you guys aren't following me on Instagram, I still don't understand, I just don't get it. Also on Twitter, if you aren't woke, if you are not woke and for some reason you really want to be woke, um, follow me on Twitter because I can help you with that. I feel like I'm very moral, I'm very logical, and I'm very wise, especially for my age. I'm still getting wiser as we all are, but if you guys want to get a little bit of wisdom and a little bit of uh, shit talking on the side, go to my Twitter because my Twitter be jumping off. I don't have a lot of followers on there, so I just be jumping off on myself, but once y'all come on over and have fun with me, it's going to be a fucking party. I also wanted to tell you guys that my Mercury is back up. If you guys didn't know, Mercury is where I sell the clothing that I don't wear anymore. It's been jumping for the past few weeks actually so if you guys are missing out don't miss out I'm posting new things on there weekly as well because I just realized that my my closet it's gonna collapse soon a lot of things I love but I just can't have that many clothes so I'm posting them on my mercury so make sure you guys pay attention um, because I don't sell things for expensive I want to say the most expensive thing on there is 25 bucks and I'm offering free shipping so yeah, check that out. If you guys wanna bundle some things, and if you guys wanna pay me like through Cash App or through a different app, we could do that too, just hit me up through Instagram, but don't say it on the Mercury app because they will delete you and they will block you from the app because they don't want you guys buying things outside the app. You get me? So yeah, there's that. I'm five foot 10 and I got everything in a one X. Now let's get into this haul, baby girl. You see this come on up? Check out my little kimono. I got this kimono. I'm actually the one who modeled it on the website. And when I put it on, I was like, uh, I'm lucky about to get this for my new haul. Like, I'm lucky about to get this. It's nice and breezy. Fall is coming around, so I'm starting to get into long sleeves and like, you know, things that's gonna cover up and also fashion pieces because I really get to play with my fashion in fall. When it's winter, I really be just trying to be warm. When it's summer, I really just be trying to be cool. In fall, that happy medium where I can actually put on a bunch of clothes and layer and do all that fun stuff. I love fall. Fall is my favorite season. Also, my birthday falls in fall, so hello, it's a Libra gang, Libra gang. It's the, let me not gang bang on here. Look how cute this is. A nice little statement piece. Obviously, I want on just a regular black dress that's like oversized, ill-fitting. Just a stupid dress that I put, pulled out my closet so I could wear my um, jackets and stuff. And as you can see, it just makes my outfit look fire. Now, if I throw on some heels, because you guys know I always want to throw on some heels. And these heels that I'm always wearing are from, these heels are from Amazon. I keep them at the office so that I can do these hauls for you guys or whatever, you know what I'm saying? So that's what these ones look like. Everybody's always asking me about the heels. And I realize I get new followers daily, I guess. So maybe I should say it in every video, but I'm like, I already told y'all. Floral, a little bit of like leopard or whatever type of animal print this is. A lot of just different patterns all over the place. I really like this kimono, so yeah. Let me know how y'all feel about it down below. So, Daquana White did a video and she bought this jacket maybe like a month ago or so. And on the website, I've seen this jacket so many times, but I just kept scrolling past it. When I was on Daquana's video, I was like, yo, I need that jacket. But then I was just like, wait a second, I don't see it on the website. So when I was on the website the other day, I was just like, wait a second, is this that jacket that Dupont had in her video? So I clicked it and indeed it was. Now I'm sure it looked just like a regular denim yellow jacket, which it's like, okay, that's cool, it's different. Not a lot of people have yellow denim jackets. But the thing that makes this jacket stand out the most is the fact that it is cropped. It's cropped. It's cropped at the back, y'all. So that means if you're wearing some pants to make your booty look good, and you don't want to put on a jacket that's gonna mess up the vibe, you know what I'm saying? You trying to show that booty off. You trying to show them that dump that you've been working out in the gym, you feel me? I love this jacket. It's a bit oversized, kind of like, you know, a little swag daddy to it, you feel me? A little swag jacket. It has 
black detailing. I think this is black or maybe a dark brown. A little colorblind, but I think it's black. I just took the tape off the buttons in the front. I can't be bothered with this right now. Yes, I can. Stop being lazy. Don't be lazy, y'all. Look at it. That took you, what, three seconds? I literally have to tell myself out loud, like, don't be lazy. That's not cute. Like, <laughs> because there's some things that I do, like, throwing shit on the floor. If I drop something in the store or something like that, and I just be like, oh, I'm not picking it up. It's like it's going to take two seconds out of your life to not be lazy and to fix something up around you. So I'm really bettering myself in that aspect. So, yeah, this is what it looks like when you take the white tape off. I took it off the front. So, yeah, super cute jacket, but this is definitely the best part of it. Girl. Do I have anything to say to y'all? Probably not. The only thing I would probably want is to tighten it right here for myself. Just so I can make sure my boobs chill on top of this little line. But other than that, because I hate adjusting my boobs in public, obviously everybody does, but you know what I'm saying? Other than that, this dress is perfect. Are you kidding me? It's one of them that I don't got nothing to say about. Y'all could just look at it. If you have some boob tape, you can probably just tape your boobs up and that'll make it a lot easier. But for me, I don't like using that type of stuff on my boobs. Um, so I just like the fact that it has like this little place designated for your boobs. But I wouldn't be able to wear a bra with it, I know, because I modeled both colors on the website. So if you guys like the other color, I would recommend you getting it, but you would have to wear it without a bra. But when we were modeling, I had a bra on for the first one, but I didn't have a bra on for the second one. So this one just looks better to me on the website. So the champagne color one is fire. As a matter of fact, I should have probably got the champagne color one. Yeah, I would just recommend don't wear it with a bra because it has this little place. Unless your boobs are smaller. If your boobs are smaller, then you'll probably be able to get away, get away with it, but... This is barely enough space for my boobs. <laughs> and I'm a 36 double D now. Okay. Excuse me, I'm not moving from here because I'm too busy stepping on you young bitches necks. <laughs> Look, I'm in the almost 30 club. This is just giving me almost 30. That's all it's giving me. Ooh. I didn't start saying that now because my birthday, technically I'm way closer to 30. <coughs> I'm way closer to 30 than I am to 25. So, I'm on my grown and sexy vibe, you feel me? It doesn't look like this on the website because, I don't know, maybe they didn't tighten the belt tight enough, but girl, this belt is so legit. I'm gonna be using this belt for everything. It doesn't even have like a, you know one of those little things where you like put the thing through so it stays? It don't even got that, so I don't even necessarily know how it's staying so tight, but that thing got me snatched, boy, check it out. The front, it looks like it's a wrap dress, so it has kind of like a V angle at the, at the knee, and then it's long at the back. So if you have any like cute little dinner dates or something that you're gonna be going on anytime soon, then I definitely recommend this cute dress. The colors on it are very bold and rich. It's not like yellow and orange. It's like, it's like Dijon and like blood orange. And you know what I'm saying? Is that like, I don't even know. Like it's just, I can't, it's just rich. I'm just rich. I'm rich. I'm rich in this dress. <sighs> This is supposed to be a basic dress, so how come it doesn't look basic? It's far from basic. I've seen other companies make dresses like this, similar to this. I've tried dresses that look similar to this. None of them, for one, feel the way this one feels. None of them are as cute and delicate and dainty as this one is. Look at the little ruffles, the little ruffles at the wrist. Okay, exactly. The fact that, like, I don't know, 
I don't know how to explain what material this is, but girl, when I tell you I feel so comfortable in this dress, like, I love this. Where I'm going to tonight, because I'm finna wear this, and I'm finna be twerking in it. You already know, so if you ain't following me on Snapchat, that's why I post the twerk videos. I don't post the twerk videos on Instagram, because that's where the sponsors is at, you feel me? I only post the twerk videos on Snapchat. <laughs> but all my friends are like turned down and old and stuff like that, so I don't really go out as much as I used to. I miss those days, but I feel like that's where I get my sanity back, so I might have to just turn the hell up this weekend. So make sure you follow me on Snapchat. You'll get 24 hours of ratchetness with me. <laughs> really comfortable, it's long sleeve. It has like this little rib detailing going on and some brown buttons. Let's not even get into the color. Yeah, let's not get into the color because that's gonna take a long time to dissect. But you see it. I know you see it. A lot of people have been asking me about like my weight loss and stuff like that. I talk a lot about it on my Snapchat as well. So make sure you follow me on my Snapchat. But I can give you this hint. Back day, back day is really important for a snatched waist. A lot of people don't remember that. If you want to snatch your waist up, make sure you get your back exercises in because once you get rid of that back fat, smooth sailing, I'm telling you. So as you can see, I'm all bad, baby. little crop top it's the mama sita shoulders that used to be my favorite but you know i'm kind of growing out of it because i really love my deep v-necks now so whatever whatever but i still love me some mama sita tops because i do still love showing my shoulders wait until i get my bob hair back maybe that's what the issue is it's because normally in the summertime i go into wearing bobs and this summer i was just like no i'm not gonna let the heat ruin me i kept my long wigs the whole Summer. For the winter, I might go into bobs because I didn't get to enjoy my bobs during the summer. When that time comes, I'm sure I'm gonna want my shoulders to show a lot more again. So why wouldn't I have a shirt like this, right? The blouse has like cute little ruffle detailing at the wrist, super cute. It also has this detail that wraps around your waist and ties in the front, or you can tie it in the back, or you can tie it in the front, you can tie it in the back. So I'm glad to show you guys what the back looks like. This leather skirt that has a little red and white stripe going down the sides. Red, white, and black, actually. Um, looks like that. I don't know. This leather skirt is so different compared to all the leather skirts that are on the market right now. Like, they always fit me really weird, and the material is just super cheap. But this one is very, like, sturdy. It almost feels like real leather. It has a slip underneath that's kind of irritating. And I don't think it needs a slip because the leather's already pretty thick. And it's a good, um, you know, type of leather. But it has a slip that keeps riding up. It's, like, right here right now. Oh, no. Like, <laughs> it makes me feel like a coochie showing. But, you know, <laughs> you know when something's riding up, you're like, oh, damn, the coochie's definitely showing. But it's not. But that's how I feel right now because of the slip. Okay, I'm going to slip out. Come on, slip. Oh, I see the need for the slip. Okay, so the need for the slip comes because now it feels even more comfortable because it's not like that leather material up against my skin. Wow, when I tell you to think about everything over here complaining about something that was there for my comfort. Wow, wow, wow. Let me know how you guys feel about the skirt and the top down below. We'll let you guys get a close-up look. Look at it, there's no gap in the back. This is about to be my favorite. I'm about to get rid of all my old leather skirts. As a matter of fact, we need one like this with no, with no whatchamacallit, with no strength. Like, I can't get over the fact of how it's holding me right here. Like, none of them fit me like this. And I have like four. I promise you, I've been looking for the perfect leather skirt. And some of them are too shiny, some of them are too this, some of them are too big, some of them are too they just not made for me, but this was made for me, girl. Yeah. When I was taking the skirt off, look at the inside of the skirt. So you guys know how I was like, oh, it feels better because of the material that's rubbing up against me instead of this material. Imagine suede rubbing up against you, like you gonna get warm, but that's the reason why they have the slit. But if you pull the slip up, 
the suede. <laughs> I know I got some boss baby daddies in here and I don't have on a boss shirt right now because this is the only shirt I got, which is the one that you guys just saw. But low key, this is cute too. Got the little ruffles coming out at the wrist of the uh, blazer. This is a suit. It's like a stretchy spandex, like sexy boss suit. A little blazer situation going on. It's black and then it has like these thick leggings. They really care about the tall girls over here. So the leggings go down all the way to my ankle. Like, you guys know I said I was gonna throw a little something in there. Some things that I don't normally wear. And I don't know when I will ever need to be professional. And even when I'm supposed to be professional, normally I'm not. <laughs> which is bad news but whatever yeah i wanted to throw something in there for my professional women because i know i have some really professional baby daddies all these doctors and lawyers and nurses that be sending me their messages and their well wishes i love you guys i love all my baby daddies anyways but for you bosses check it out right and for you girls who want to be bosses you got to dress like a boss to be a boss so go ahead and get you a little blazer walk into that job interview like give me the check Give me a day. I feel like I'm probably gonna rock the heck out of this one day when people least expect me to. Cause I, yeah, yeah, yeah. When winter actually hits, when fall actually sets in, I'm about to be on some other chain. So y'all better look out. Turn your bell on. Here's my next piece. It's this maxi bodycon skirt. So pretty. You can wear something like a t-shirt, a crop top, whatever on top. You can wear it with sneakers, with Balenciagas, with bands. You can wear it with sandals, you can wear it with pumps, you can wear it with heels, you can wear it with a lace corset or a little lace bralette. You can wear it with a bodysuit, like a, oh my god, there's so many things you can do with this skirt. I feel like this type of skirt is a staple, you need to have something like this in your wardrobe. I have two. Um, I wanted to test this one out because low-key the other ones are starting to fade in color. You can always pull it up and it could be like a dress, a tube dress. If I was to pick one thing that you need in your wardrobe, it would be this skirt. You could do so many things with it, I promise. And I would love to see you guys do like a whole bunch of stuff with it and just send it to me. Ooh, lookbook, ooh, should I do a lookbook with the skirt? If you guys want me to do a lookbook with the skirt, child support is comment down below. If I get 200 people saying do lookbook, I will do a lookbook with the skirt and I'll give you 10 different styles. 200 comments saying lookbook. I will give you a lookbook with 10 different styles using this skirt. Go ahead, let me see my child support. Oh my God, Vogue, fashion, couture. <laughs> it's a little wrinkled, but you get it. I have it on with the skirt because I had the skirt on before, but i would probably rock this with pants, maybe even jeans. Ooh, some fire denim. Y'all being reckless today, but not as reckless as y'all was last week, so I'm gonna let that one slide. It's houndstooth, but you wouldn't be able to tell unless you got super, super, super close. Yeah, it's houndstooth print. It's so cute, it's off the shoulder, but it's really structured and tailored. It has all these buttons, and then it has like this extra piece of fabric just hanging down to the side. Um, the sleeves are a little bit big, but that's good because with plus size women, we want, the, we want it to fit everybody, and then the people who it's not, it doesn't fit you the way you would like it to fit, we get it tailored. So like with this, I'm, I'm definitely getting the size tailored and take it in for me, because girl, imagine, imagine if it was tight like that up against my body. I can't wait, I'm about to fix this sleeve, and I'm gonna take it in at the waist. I have a lot of visions for this, and nobody better not beat me to it. I remember I bought a dress from ASOF way back when I first started working with them and I was like nobody better not buy this dress I'm gonna be pissed. I got so many pictures of you guys being messy and buying the dress and there's this one girl who had a whole photo shoot of one of the dresses I was just pissed and I want to say she was in like Greece or something and I was like I can't top that. <laughs> I love it um, and like I said I'm about to alter it and make it even better than what it is. So that's the last piece of the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I didn't get any accessories this haul. I was just like, I literally just organized all my accessories. And um, that was like, I organized all my accessories like two days ago and I was just like, okay, it's about time to take a break. You know what I'm saying? Like you could take a little break, but I'll be back right back on it next week, trust. 
probably. If I find something cute on there next week, I'm probably gonna be back on the accessories, but I am gonna start selling my accessories as well because I have so many. And I have so many that I loved in the moment or I wanted to wear with an outfit and I got that wear out of it and now I don't need the accessory anymore. And I wanna sell them for super cheap. So I might put them on Mercury for $5. Mercury only allows you to put things on there for a minimum of $5. But if you guys want an accessory or something, all you would have to do is pay for shipping and I'll just send it to you. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you follow me on Instagram or Twitter or or snapchat so that we can arrange some things all right all right you guys know by watching my videos you automatically get 25% off of your order so make sure you put in the code BD25 at checkout for 25% off your purchase all the links where you can find the pieces that I wore in this video are gonna be down below as well as my social medias and all the ways where you can contact me so make sure you open that description box Go out and do wonderful things in the world and make sure no drama comes from anybody but me because I'm your baby mama. I love you. Now give me a kiss. Bye. 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 Come put a smile on my face Come put the smile on my face Come make me shine like the sun Come make me shine like the sun Sometimes I feel like I'm the one Sometimes I feel like it I'm the one It ain't my fault